imagine building a temple so precise? NASA's like, how the hell did they do this without computers? Now here's the wild part. It was all done using sacred geometry, like spiritual math meets God level architecture. So I was backpacking through South India, just trying to find some peace, you know? I stumble on this ancient temple. No blueprints, no concrete, but the symmetry. Bro, it slapped harder than anything I've seen in Manhattan. Every angle, every shadow, timed with the sun, the moon, the freaking equinox, and it was built over a thousand freaking years ago. Then I met this monk, real chill dude. He tells me, this isn't just math, it's divine balance, energy flow, frequency, vibration. Turns out they weren't just measuring stones. They were sinking human consciousness with the cosmos, like geometry as a spiritual weapon. Meanwhile, we're here flexing calculators and still can't align a doorknob right. So yeah, sacred geometry ain't just about triangles. It's ancient science wrapped in soul. Maybe modern math didn't evolve. Maybe it forgot. Next time you see an ancient Indian temple, don't just take a pick. Ask yourself, what did they know that we don't? And yo, if geometry class had this kind of drip, I'd have paid attention.